That's definitely the electricity it is, line. Yeah. So when you hear this buzzing noise. Well, this happened to me just the other day. So, obviously I thought, what is making this noise? I mean, I know it was the power lines, but what specifically? So, that's what we're gonna look at today. But first, we're gonna need to know a bit about the national grid. So, let's get going. The national grid is a network of wires and transformers that transfers energy from power stations to consumers. Power is the energy transferred in a certain time, so a higher power means that more energy is transferred. Consumers generally want a lot of power, so to transmit this power we either need a high voltage or a high current flowing through our wires. However, when we have a high current, we end up losing a lot of energy due to heating in the wire. So it's cheaper to use a really high voltage of 400,000 volts and keep the current low. That makes the national grid a more efficient way of transferring energy. To change the amount of voltage and current flowing through the wires, we use transformers. All transformers have two coils, the primary and the secondary coil and these are joined together with an iron core. So first we need to use a step up transformer to increase the voltage and decrease the current. These have more turns on the secondary coil than the primary coil. And after our energy has traveled long distances through the wires, we need to bring the voltage back down again so we can use it in our homes. This is where the step down transformer comes in and as you can guess they have more turns on the primary coil than the secondary coil and this reduces the voltage. The UK mains electricity that we use in our homes is alternating current, has a frequency of about 50 hertz and a potential difference of 230 volts. So thanks to the national grid, we have electricity to power our homes, industries, factories, schools, businesses, basically to power everything. So now we're getting down to it. What was making that buzzing noise? Well, it's mainly to do with a change in the condition of the insulators. And this is enabling electric current to partially conduct along it or through the surrounding air. The electricity causes molecules in the air to become charged and collide, and it's these collisions that we hear. This can happen because of a change in weather conditions or damage to the insulators. Buzzing sounds from power lines are not uncommon. In fact, they're always there, albeit not always perceptible to the human ear. This is usually caused by alternating current being applied to a transformer, which causes vibrations in the wires, which we can hear as a certain frequency. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and if you have any questions or suggestions for the videos, pop them in the comments, and I'll see you next time. Um, I forgot what I was saying.